What's up guys, and I'm very late on this review, you know, I had his highlights all stacked up, just never got around to uploading it, but here we go, Super Bowl Wilson milestone version as well, 5'11", 91 speed, 90 where it is, 93 throw mid, 95 throw on the run, 88 play action, 93 throw short, 92 throw power, and 88 deep throw, juke and spin is nice, but as I've said so many times before, man, don't risk it with the quarterback, even though his, his uh, carry rating is not that bad compared to most quarterbacks still, just take what you can get and slide. And short throw, no problem as you would expect. And of course, you know, I've played against so many guys who so just live off short throws in their, you know, um, scheme. So if you're one of those guys, man, there's no reason he shouldn't fit your, your style of play. And as far as the most important throwing attribute, the mid throw, did not really see any bad throws. In fact, I don't think I had a single bad mid throw from him. So, you know, and of course, killing cover too, man. You see right there, man, the mid throw you need to have a good quarterback with a good mid throw to make this successful. As you can see, man. A great quarterback when it comes to a killing the cover too. Now naturally the deep throw did worry me at first. 88 deep throw is nothing to brag about but I believe he had like nine successful deep throws and only one bad one. Guys that is not a bad percentage man. That is an amazing percentage. Big surprise there. I mean look just hitting the receiver in stride whether it's Mike Wallace or Will Fuller whoever it is that's going deep. I mean look right here this is just ridiculous man how far he can throw it. And right there this was this play right here was overtime and look at the clutch throw man deep to hit my receiver for the touchdown and throwing on the run man is always going to be good with Russell Wilson man whether it's to the left to the right look at that right there perfect throw on the run did have a few or maybe one or two bad throws on the run you see here's one and the deep throw that I was referring to which is right here that one bad deep pass that could have been a touchdown but hey of course man nobody's perfect and this right here is why you should slide man slide 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 even though I know trust me guys I get it the temptation to want to try to fall forward and he definitely can break tackles here and there, but I just want to show you right here, man. He is, you know, it, it, it's not impossible to make him fumble is what I'm saying. But this right here, of course, is the major selling point. You know, his scrambling ability. He's not always going to fumble, of course. You know, I have, I think I have maybe like, I don't know, a total of maybe 17 total runs with, you know, with contact and not fumble. But he did have those two fumbles, of course, that, that you did just see. So even though, you know, I don't want to be a hypocrite because you see me here, man, not even attempting to slide, even though some of these I was trying to slide, but I just pressed the buttons too late. But look at this play right here, man. Look at this play. It was ridiculous, man. Three tackles, including one from Clowny, man, I believe that was. So a great scrambler, no doubt about it. So that's going to wrap this up, guys. Right now he goes for like 200K. That's not that bad, honestly, especially with that conductor chemistry. That makes him that much more valuable. So if you want to turn him into a pocket quarterback, you saw, you know, you saw yourself go ahead and do it. If you want to scramble with him, even though it is tempting to want to keep to a fall forward with them, I still suggest sliding if you can. But anyways, guys, that's going to wrap this up. I do have a couple more videos coming out very soon. So anyways, guys, I'll see you boys then. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you boys later. Peace.